Hey everyone, this is Marjorie Green. I am excited to talk to you guys today. I want to go through the entire story of everything that's been going on. Have you guys been following 4chan, Q, any of that stuff? Anybody? It's a story that if you were actually to write this in a book, um, honestly, I probably would quit reading the book because it's so unbelievable. It's an anonymous person. All right, so um, Q is a patriot. We know that for sure. It's not just Democrat and Republican, left and right. You can dive down in that civil war into deeper levels where we have basically the deep state is fighting back against President Trump, his loyal, the loyal people in his administration, and the American people, okay? I mean, is it going to be true that the child pedophilia in the elites in the Washington, D.C., is that what we're really going to see come out? Is it true? Is the type of corruption we're going to see come out? Is it going to be satanic worship that possibly all these people are involved in? Have you seen, and I've asked Will this before, the picture of Ruth Bader Gingrich walking through the airport? This woman has been drawn over for how many years? And all of a sudden, she's walking straight up right like it's a whole new it's person. Almost like Do a body double like that Hillary is Clinton. Ruth? Yeah, like, like yes. the body double for Hillary Clinton, so... It's interesting. Yeah. So I do not believe that was Ruth. No, I don't think so. There's possible satanic worship and maybe that all these scary things that that people talk about on what's considered conspiracy th conspiracy sites and conspiracy theories really may be true. Um, but that's that's what Q has been telling everyone. We had witnessed 9-11, right? We had witnessed 9-11, uh, the terrorist attack. Um, in New York and the plane that uh, crashed in Pennsylvania and the so-called plane that crashed into the Pentagon. It's odd. There's never any evidence shown for a plane in the Pentagon. But anyways, I won't, I'm not going to dive into the 9-11 conspiracy. Q is trying to tell people on these forums and 4chan, and he's trying to tell people the truth. And he does it through questions, asking questions, asking questions, and giving clues. And so it's basically, you know, you're going down the rabbit hole. You're following the white rabbit, and you're figuring it out. I've got a question for you. How do you get avid gun owners and people that support the Second Amendment to give up their guns and go along with anti-gun legislation? Maybe you accomplish that by performing a mass shooting into a crowd that is very likely to be conservative, very likely to vote Republican, very likely to be Trump supporters, very likely to be pro-Second Amendment, and very likely to own guns. Is that what happened in Las Vegas? Is that why um, the country music festival was targeted? I have a lot of questions about that. I don't believe Stephen Paddock was a lone wolf. I don't believe that he pulled this off all by himself. They destabilized the Middle East. That's what happened, okay? So that, <laughs> that happened during Barack Obama's presidency. Okay, but let's keep going. Let's keep talking about whatever happened. Yes, I do believe he is a Muslim. And yes, Valerie Jarrett is too, and she's a big issue too. According to Q, now I'm saying according to Q, again, I don't have any proof of this, but I'm, we're talking about who is Q, so I'm going to tell you what he says. According to him, many in our government are actively worshiping Satan, or they call Moloch. MS-13, everyone, under Obama came MS-13. There's a lot to that. You have to understand. There's, they, have very good, they had very good relationships with MS-13. MS-13 was basically like, they were the, kind of the henchmen of the Obama administration. They did a lot of the dirty work. Seth Rich. Seth Rich was murdered by two MS-13 gang members. That's what I mean by dirty work, okay? There's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to take this global cable of Satan-worshipping pedophiles out, and I think we have the president to do it, and so I'm very excited about that. Hillary decides to um, launch her political career. It's time for her to enter because, you know, she's being lined up. She's the next one in place, the deep state. They choose who their um, candidates are. They choose who they want to put in place. So she becomes senator um, in New York City. And yes, I could dive into uh, Kennedy getting killed in the plane crash because isn't it interesting that he had announced he was going to run for Senate just before he died in a mysterious plane crash. But anyway, so that's another one of those um, Clinton murders, right? 
These are interesting things to look at, and so I wanted to talk to you about them. I'm not presenting them that they're fact, but I am presenting them that I'm hoping they're facts.